Hi and thanks for joining me today. In this video we're going to talk about how you can use Photoshop to create an animated GIF file. Now if you've already got Photoshop it's pretty easy to do this and you don't have to go out and buy any extra expensive software or try to rely on something that's free on the internet that may not work the way you want it to. Now um, first of all you'll want to go ahead and make sure that you already have your pictures pre-selected and you'll want to kind of make sure that they're about the, roughly the same size so that your animated GIF kind of looks smooth and normal but um, in this tutorial I'm just gonna go ahead and just use some rough pictures that I've got that I want to throw together just to show you how to do this once you open Photoshop you'll go up to the file menu and go down to the scripts menu and choose load files into stack from here you're going to click browse and you're going to find your pictures and in this case I'm just going to multi I'm going to hold down the control key on my keyboard to multi select some pictures so I'll choose some pictures here and just scroll through and we'll do this really quickly and then once you've chosen your pictures you hit OK and here are the four pictures I want so I just click OK and so here they are they're loaded onto the page and the next thing that we're going to do after they're all loaded over there they're also loading here on the timeline on the right hand side we're going to go down to the timeline bar at the bottom of photoshop so here we're going to click create frame animation so it's loaded those layers into the timeline and then over on the right i'm going to choose two options from this menu i'm going to choose create new layers for each new frame which it's already done that and then I'm going to choose make frames from layers so now instead of all of the pictures being in one layer now they're each their own separate layer then at the bottom I'm going to choose how long I want each of these pictures to appear in our GIF file and I'm just going to make them each appear for one second and then finally down here where it says once that's basically the option where we choose our looping and we want to tell it that we want this to loop forever now if you want to see what that looks like you can always just hit the play button it may take some time to load but it'll give you an idea of what it's going to look like once that's all looped together so there we are that's what it's going to look like now we're almost done so now we're going to go up to the file menu and we're going to choose save for web and you'll get this menu and so at the top we want to make sure that it is set to a GIF file and we want to set the preset to 128 dithered we'll leave that alone go to the bottom and click save we'll choose a destination for that and I'm going to save it and that's it we now have our GIF file so let's go ahead and go over to the desktop and see what that looks like so here is my GIF and I'm going to double click on that and it will load a browser so that we can see what it looks like on the web and there you have it that's a quick way to make an animated GIF file with Photoshop well thanks for joining me if you have any questions feel free to contact me through my website www.techiecoach.com